Here's a trick that you can use to knit garter stitch in the round without having to purl. Yay! It's gonna be awesome. Okay, so on a tiny swatch like this, it doesn't obviously really make much sense to like do a bunch to avoid purling, but let's say you're knitting, um, I don't know, something bigger, a hat in garter stitch. For me, I would much rather knit the whole thing I'm using this little trick rather than switch between knitting and purling just in order to make garter stitch, right? So here's the trick. Um, I've casted on 16 stitches and divided them for magic loop and I went ahead and uh, knit one round in magic loop and then I did the trick and I knit, knit another round. So you can see I have two rounds of garter stitch here. And this is the trick. Let's pull the back needle out. We're basically going to do a wrap and turn right here and I don't even think you can see Surely you can't see it from a galloping horse. This is what you do. Slip the stitch, the first stitch here of the row. You can see we're at the beginning of the round here because of the tail, right? Slip the first stitch to the right-hand needle, bring the yarn to the front like this, through the tips of the needles like that, and put the stitch back on. All right, now it's time to get back to ready position. That's our wrap, but we need to turn now. So it's time to get back to ready position. Pinch the tip here so that your stitches don't slide off. Like that, pinch the tip, and pull this cable, push the needle back in there, and this is what we're going to do. See that? This is the fastest way to get back to ready position now that we've changed direction. Because see, our yarn is coming off the back needle now. Oops, let's tuck that in there. Let's get that out of the way. This tail. Okay. Now our yarn is coming off the back needle, more or less, right? And we've what it is, this is the wrap that we made right here. So when I pull it tight, you can see what happens. There we go. So it just loops in around this stitch right here and comes back. So now let's start knitting. Pull out the back needle, just like we normally do for Magic Loop. And go ahead and knit into that first stitch. Make sure to pull that wrap tight. We don't want a big loose thread right there. All right, and go ahead and knit one round in garter stitch like that make sure you know where your round end is it's over here so let's drop the needle turn everything around pull the cable push the needle back in pull the back needle out and finish this uh, finish this round and then we'll turn around again There are a pair of um, slippers that are really cute called Prairie Boots. They're by um, Coco Knits. They're by Julie Weissenberger of Coco Knits. And they are garter stitch. And they're more or less in the round. The top part becomes not in the round. But let's get back to ready position here. But for the most part, you knit like the whole foot. You knit these whole house slippers and they're garter stitch in the round. And I use this technique to like make that project so fast and a lot more fun, I think. All right, let's do it again. It's time to it's time to turn around again. Pull the back needle out. Let's do our wrap. Slip the stitch here. Whoops. Like that to the right-hand needle. Move the yarn to the front. And if you're knitting American style, it's going to look the same. Let's get some more yarn here. If you're knitting American style, it's going to look the same. It's going to look like this. Your yarn is in back. Move your yarn to the front like that. And, oh, that's hard. <laughs> and move the stitch back. Let's get back to ready position. Pinch here. Pull the, the cable with the loose needle on it. Like that. And ready. Put the needle that has the working yarn on it in the back. Push that tail through. All right, if this were my project, I'd probably weave that end in right now because it's bugging me. And just stick a marker right there. All right. Our yarn's coming off the back needle, more or less. Pull tight right there, there's our wrap. There it is right there. So go ahead and pull that tight. Pull the back needle out. Let's get ready to knit. And you can see that we're working in garter stitch. These all look like purl stitches. We've got all these purl bumps here, even though you and I know that I just knitted that whole last round. So I really hope you like this trick. Like, you do not have to do... You do not have to purl if you don't want to anymore. All right. 
So there's what it's starting to look like. Super easy.